uh, Jigsaw. Now, you know, this is the kind of movie that if you enjoyed the last, I don't know, what was it, five Saw movies? Seven, I think. Seven? Oh, okay, well, there you go. Yeah, you're, right. you're, going, you're, going to win, you're going to go, and nothing's going to stop you from seeing this next one. Okay. That's, you're, you're there. Yeah. Um, Geostorm. Uh, man, talk about a trailer not being able to save you at all. Mm-hmm. That's This movie looked so bad that uh, oh, right. it was, uh, you know, even Andy Garcia looked like, look, he was almost apologizing in the trailer. This is all I can get now. <laughs> this is it really felt like I felt right. kind of bad for him. Like, my kids are yeah. going to college, so I yeah. really this needs yeah. to. Happen. <laughs> I need a new roof on my third home. <laughs> yeah, it's one of those deals, huh? So, um, and I, I love when they say. Movie? <laughs> and you know, it's got that classic part where they actually say the name of the film in the trailer. It's like it's. It's a geostorm. <laughs> and all of a sudden, all these little tiny geo cars just fall from yeah. the sky. <laughs> what they should do when they do that in a movie, I think it's a geostorm. They should just, the title should just boom, mm, yeah. come on the frame with a big, bold graphic. Yeah. Brought to you by GE. <laughs> geostorm. <laughs> Uh, yeah, um, that that one looked too cheeseball-y for me to even go for the, tr- the movie poster looks cheeseball yeah. yes. That's when you know you're in trouble. Uh, thank you for your service. This was the Miles Teller PTSD movie. Mm-hmm. Um, I saw this film. Um, there was some interesting stuff in it. I, mm-hmm. I, you know, If you didn't see it, it's worth seeing. There's some good performances in it. Mm-hmm. Wait, what, what's this one about again? Thank you for your service. So yeah. Miles Teller plays a bunch of guys that came back from Iraq with PTSD, and they're trying to... Oh, yeah. okay. It's a, it's a, it sounds like one I would like. Yeah, it's a pretty good movie All right. from what I remember. Um, That's on DVD right now? Yes, sir. Mm-hmm. Okay, good deal. And goodbye, Christopher Robin. This was the story of how uh, Winnie the Pooh was created by the the author, and it kind of goes through his life and his relationship with his his son. Um, and also, as his son kind of got famous, as people learned that the stories were based on him, then it was like that um, that version of fame and that time period and how... Uh, awkward it was, and ultimately it, it it began estranging him from his uh, his parents. So it, it's a decent movie. Margot Robbie does a good job in it, mm-hmm. but it's 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 another kind of movie that really felt like oh this is Oscar bait, and it, it just mm, no not not quite. It didn't quite get there. It, again, it it goes off on some um, weird places like like the the one part that I think I had the most problem with like. Was the they go out to a house in the country? Mm-hmm. Okay, it's the 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 mother, the father, and the daughter and the son, excuse me. And um, the mother just decides, I don't like it here. I'm going back to the city. So, okay, you're just leaving. Is okay. that that what you're doing? All right, okay. And then um, she comes back a while later, and the husband, this is the, it's A. A. Milne. Is that mm-hmm. the name? Yeah, yeah. A. Milne asks, Hey, well, what have you been doing all this time? Does it matter? I'm back now. And like, yeah, kind of matters. Yeah, yeah, yeah. kind of matters yeah. what you've been done. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I kind of well, need to know where you to were. Hide? Yeah, <laughs> what you were doing and where you were, and uh, you know, it's you've been gone for a while. Yeah. Uh, so, so there was a couple. Of, he just kind of let that go. Interesting. Uh, that so, really would have fucked up Green Acres. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> the wife was just like, "Fuck it, now nah, I'm out of here." Yeah. Well, then we have no show. So, <laughs> the movie it was a uh, it was a little too long. It was a little um it it just it it, it missed the mark a little bit for sure, but. It was a. Um, it was definitely an acting character piece for uh, Dom Hall Gleason, All right. for sure. Like for him, his performance, you're like, it's kind of his movie. Mm-hmm. Like Margot Robbie is good in supporting, but really, it's it's more about him. And uh, what I did like too uh, was that it went into that uh, A. Milne. Am I saying that right? A. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. He uh, he went. He was more than just the Winnie the Pooh author. Like he, he wrote articles, he wrote other books, and he, he did other things. And he was he had a lot to say about the war, and and there was mm-hmm. there was a lot going on. It wasn't just about Winnie the Pooh for him. So um, it's decent. It's an airplane movie. Okay. It's, uh, ah, there you go. It's something to see on an airplane. No nudity scenes in yeah. this one, except for Pooh Bear, who's just wearing yeah. a shirt. Yeah, that's that's it. That's all a little odd. The what characters. t-shirt contest with Pooh Bear's yeah. a little weird. That seems weird, yeah. but yeah. I think it's, yeah. you know, it's still a cartoon at the yeah. end of the day, so <laughs> no one really cares. still completely naked. <laughs> Tigger's still uh, naked. Uh, and the next movie is The Killing of a Sacred Deer. This is just this weird kind of horror thriller uh, about a stranger who comes into a family's life. But what, what intrigued me about it was it was the guy that did The Lobster, because that was such a fucked up movie. Yes. 
That oh. was uh, that was such a fucked up movie. And so this one, I'm thinking, well, this has got to be. Well, the lobster, like the like the the freak show, like the the lobster hands. Well, no, it's that's it's a, a it's it's even hard. <laughs> it's it's one of those movies that's even hard to describe. Okay. It's like if you don't fall in love Peaky with Barnum somebody, in my head. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. if you don't fall in love with a, at a certain amount of time with somebody, then you get turned into the animal of your choice for, at this resort. Oh, okay, interesting. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> lobster, huh? Well, yeah. you know, they got claws. So, um, this was this is his next film. Interesting. Um, so the the killing of the sacred deer. Yeah. Right. So it's kind of a horror thriller. About a stranger comes into a family's life. I'm gonna whisper about it. Yeah, <laughs> it takes it makes it more creepy and, and, and yes. serious. Yeah, <laughs> it's like yeah. Well, he just yeah. whispered so, on that one. I right. check that one out. And also, for the uh, a good way to hide your jungle teeth. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> ah, I heard one guy with a call. You don't even have to move your mouth at all when you whisper. Just keep mm-hmm. your lips close to each other. If mm-hmm. you got that Sam Elliott mm-hmm. mustache, you can see your mouth move at all. Yeah. yeah, it's like your mannequin. Yeah. Well, then you just make things and you draw. It That's out. a good one. You got a good accent. Thank you, sir. <laughs> now I'm <a> hickory. Yeah. <laughs> We're kind of famous. Pig from Green Acres hailed from hickory. <laughs> one thing you didn't know about that pig, he was mean as a snake. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. He had fire in his eyes that day. He'd bite your got dang hand off. <laughs> My, you try to feed him, you come up with a nub. My, <laughs> my cousin lost three fingers that big. <laughs> Once the camera stopped rolling. Yeah, he got me. He's a mean drunk. <laughs> he looked good in that one shirt, though. Him and, him and Winnie the Pooh together. <laughs> Just that tank top. That's a good couple. Yeah. And then give it to Lara Croft. <laughs> <laughs> Laura Croft is from Hickory. I don't yes. know if you guys know that. She's a lot of people don't know that. <laughs> yeah. Fun fact, uh, trivia. It's on Wikipedia. Laura Croft, so. born from Hickory, <laughs> moved out later. Yeah. Yeah. And. Uh... I shot first. Kitten heads across the. Room.